Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of color lithiasis and color docolithiasis. A 40 year old female patient came with right upper abdominal pain. She had also complained about vomiting repeatedly. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the longitudinal section of the gallbladder. You can see multiple bright echogenic structures of variable size seen within the gallbladder lumen casting postoacoustic shadows. Right now, due to gravity, they are within the posture wall. These echogenic structures are nothing but the gallbladder calculi. The gallbladder wall is normal in thickness and though the lumen looks quite distended, but it is within normal limit of less than 4 cm. Whenever you see calculi within the gallbladder lumen, you definitely should look for the common bile duct to exclude any calculus or any other abnormality there. So here's the common bile duct which looks dilated. You can see the intrahepatic biliary tree are also dilated here. Now if you look carefully, you can see a bright echogenic structure is also noted within the common bile duct lumen casting postreacoustic shadow. So this is nothing but the common bile duct calculus known as cholidocolithiasis. Here's the picture. You can see the gallbladder lumen contains multiple echogenic calculi casting postreacoustic shadows. And also, this is the common bile duct which is dilated. This is the portal vein, and the tiny structure here is nothing but the right hepatic artery. Here's another picture. You can see the gallbladder lumen contains calculi. And also on the left picture, you can see the common bile duct is dilated. Also, the intrahepatic biliary tree looks dilated here. And this echogenic structure is nothing but the common bile duct calculus. Here is another picture of the common bile duct calculus causing proximal dilatation. The common bile duct calculus measures around 16 mm in diameter and these are the dilated intrahepatic biliary channels. As the gallbladder looks quite filled, you easily can use three-dimensional ultrasound to get a good picture. Here's the three-dimensional view of the gallbladder lumen containing calculi. You can see a mucosal fold here also, and these are the calculi. We have used the skeleton mode of 3D to see the calculi here. Another view of the gallbladder calculi, this is the right kidney. Here's another view of the gallbladder calculi. And the view of the gallbladder calculi. And this is nothing but the mucosal fold with calculi. So, in summary, multiple bright echogenic structures of variable size are seen within the gallbladder lumen, casting postreacoustic shadows. The common bile duct is dilated with an echogenic structure casting postreacoustic shadow within the lumen, causing proximal dilatation of the common bile duct and the intrahepatic biliary tree. So, this feature is concluded as a case of colored lithiasis with colored 
Now the take home message. Whenever you see a common bile duct calculus with dilated biliary tree, don't just stop ending the diagnosis as cholecholithiasis. You should try to look for any distal growth or mass within the common bile duct. So if you need to exclude that, you can also use other imaging modality correlation. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and try to visit our website imagingstudy.com. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.